welcome to webstar press wordpress sliders and carousels are many problem is to find a multi-purpose functional flexible and easy to use carousel that has all the needed features that we need create beautiful carousels with images posts or products easily no coding is required and it's free select images from wordpress media library drag and drop them into place and create carousel create carousel with wordpress posts or woocommerce products it's fully responsive highly customizable and works smoothly across all devices in this video we will look into that but before that give this video a like subscribe to the channel if you haven't already because i am bringing similar content on this topic okay to do that from wordpress dashboard go to plugins add new search for carousel slider gallery by wp carousel carousel slider gallery by wp carousel image carousel and photo gallery post carousel and post grid product carousel and product grid for woocommerce install and activate this is wp carousel it's image carousel for wordpress post carousel for wordpress and products carousel for wordpress After it's installed, you can start creating carousel or go to its settings. Here we have Swiper CSS, Font Awesome CSS, and Swiper JS. From here, you can choose the way they are used in your WordPress site. Responsive breakpoint settings define your own breakpoints for carousel by adjusting minimum screen width for desktop for laptop for tablet and for mobile apply custom css if you need to all right all carousels add a new and here is how we add a new carousel give it a title choose source type image post or product in case of images, add images by clicking this add image icon. Three images selected. Choose layout type, carousel or grid. Choose gap between images. Set number of columns on different devices. Publish. After publishing, we've got this short code to use in posts, pages, or if you're using Elementor, you can use this short code using Elementor as well. And if you want to apply code in theme, you can use this PHP code to include in your template. I will use short code. Add new page. Paste the short code. Hit publish. Let's see the output. And here is the carousel. If these images are not same in height, we can adjust this as well. But before that, let's try grid. Update. Reload. And here is the grid. Image settings. Image size. Let's use WooCommerce thumbnail. 300 by 300. Update. Reload. Now image size is same. General settings. Carousel update for carousel now images heights are equal carousel setting you can adjust auto play speed sliding speed pause on over infinity loop you can enable disable touch swipe mouse draggable show hide pagination choose pagination color show hide navigation adjust navigation color 
again general settings and here let's choose three columns for desktop three for laptop update reload and we have got bigger images in slider now for the posts we can limit the post from here we can again choose carousel or grid update reload and now we have got posts carousel style settings you can show hide certain things like post title post content date and author for image post and product WP Carousel has got different style settings. For example, for product, you can choose to show or hide product name, product price, rating, add to cart button. Let's choose product. Update. Reload. And here is product carousel. So as a free option, you can display slider or carousel by using posts, products or images. You can show hide certain things to customize the slider in case of posts and products. If images are not even, you can choose different image size from image settings. So there you go, easy to use free carousel for WordPress. I recommend free WordPress plugins that are the best, but I will recommend the one that has value, even if it's not free. My aim is to recommend plugins that work and make your life easy while working with WordPress. So try WP Carousel and let me know in comments if you have better alternative to this. I have already shared few slider or carousel plugins that are even more flexible than this i will link those tutorials in description okay i hope it helped like share subscribe and i will see you in the next video